Ocean Sailing Nikau, we are in Barbados and we're going to do a little bit of exploring on the island, definitely going to do some diving and uh, check out this amazing island and this first stop really, uh, if you're sailing from the Mediterranean, the first stop to the Caribbean, Barbados. Welcome to this episode of Sailing Nika. We are in Barbados. Yes, we are. We're on a bus pumping reggae music, going up from Bridgetown to Spatestown. We're going to try and grab some lunch at a beach bar called George's. It's been recommended to us. And it should be fun exploring this island a little bit. Over the next few days, we're going to be heading off from Barbados down to the Grenadines. It's going to be awesome. <laughs> J'ai Dr. Groove, Salama et la connexion dans ta collection Reggae in a harmony With liberty we play Hey yeah See now I'm a family I feel so free with you Yeah Fuck in a liveliness A hitliness with you Ooh yeah See now I'm a friend we just jumped off the bus in Spatestown. We're gonna go and find some lunch. What did you think of the bus ride? It was really interesting. It was really bumpy, lots of reggae music, really loud, but it was really cool seeing the country a different way than normal. Hey yeah, they look like us. I meant to tell you how this works, but I actually don't know how it works. It's kind of like a buffet where we just help us out, but the problem is, is that we're just going to put too much stuff and get charged a ridiculous amount of money. Like we did yesterday. Yeah. Well, you tell the lady what you want, and she puts it on your plate. It's pretty good. Oh, I know. Yeah. What's it like, dude? Hundred and eighteen Barbadian dollars. Not really. It's only about a hundred New Zealand dollars. You've got a lot of food, and it's a pretty nice location. Fisherman's Wharf. It's been so great to get the dive compressor crank in. We've already had a few dives. There are so many amazing wrecks here in Barbados, and uh, all within clustered within a little group. I think there's five or six of them and uh, it is so much fun taking the kids down for some of their first dives, taking some of the other boats around, they can snorkel over them. Some of them are only like two meters deep so it's just really cool for kids and uh, just littered with coral and amazing fish and um, some great little swim throughs through the wrecks. I even was able to sit on a World War II toilet underwater which is pretty cool. We're here at Bridgetown in Carlisle Bay with about 12 other boats, most of them all with kids on board, so the kids are having a great time talking to each other on the VHF, zooming around the bay. I think there's about five different families on board right now thumping around like elephants. They've started a band with a few biscuit tins and a ukulele. Hey, Blue, this is Corey Quarry, over. More people on the radio. Full of kitties. Uh, first of all, what do we think of Barbados? It's sweet. And cool. it's cool and it's, a lot and it's a lot warmer than Europe. Yeah, yep. and, and definitely and warmer. The randomly rains. Randomly it rains. does, there's like little squalls and stuff. And how was your passage guys? Everyone had a different passage? It sucked. I was so sucked. Sad, except for the last few days. It sucked. No, it sucked. It sucked, eh? What sucked about it, Max? The ginormous, the waves. Oh, the waves. Who was bored on passage? Everyone no, was bored really on passage. I, I was Who really was bored. scared on passage? Anyone ever scared on passage? I think I could put my hand up for that. I was sometimes scared. Um, did you have some good family times though? Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. We played DOS. You played what? DOS. 
What's we'll that? We'll see. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, and um, hey, hey, yeah, best oh, yeah. thing about Passage? Uh, Christmas. Christmas, yeah. First Christmas. Our worst thing about passage? Uh, waves. Autumn. Anyone see a whale? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Got some whales. We Lots saw, of whales. We saw, we saw a sperm whale. Yeah. Pilot whale. Yeah. <laughs> Any pirates? Any pirates on your travels? Oh, we had a, um, we had a, um, we had one of those stowaways. Stowaways. Yeah. Stowaways. Yeah. 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 Some stowaway snails on the back. For other kids that are watching, who might be a little bit scared to do it and think that they're going to be really bored. Should they do it anyway? Is it a cool experience? Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's cool, but it's insanely boring. It's not that. Yeah, it's, it's cool, but it's really boring. Right. The reward hey, is awesome. Did the you reward, reward awesome? is awesome. Yeah. Cool. awesome. Cool. Yeah. And for parents that are watch watching that are a little bit scared to take their kids out of school and do something different, what would you say to them? Do Just it. do it, man. Do it. Do do it. it. Do Don't be a wuss. Give them chocolate, yeah. There you have it from the kids. Don't be a wuss. Just give the kids chocolate and lollies and they'll have a great time. Get yourself a boat if you can and go cruising the world. David on my dingy, David on my dingy, David on my ding, 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 dingy. Woo! Mom dedicated to Dad who re shipped us asking us for David on the dingy. What were we doing, honey? She well, always done a lot of planning. Now we're gonna go planning for what? For the Caribbean, yeah. the Panama. Where we're going, all, all what we're gonna do things. with all of these dudes from different boats. Hey, good time, good time. Saying goodbye to a lot of friends today and then cruising with a lot of friends tomorrow off to Grenada. All of these guys in the background have come all the way from the Med with us and uh, it's the perfect place to uh, chill out and uh, have a beer. Three beers for 10 bucks. Pretty good, 10 New Zealand dollars. And uh, having some sundowners and then we're saying goodbye tomorrow. Head in for Grenada. and we're here in Granada. Uh, we hooked about three fish, got one tuna, a couple got away, one took my lure, wasn't so good. This is a small little yellow fin but made for some good food last night. And uh, we have been sailing all night, we just put the motor on now.
Chocolate from this is the fruit, and this is where the um, beans are inside, and you just suck it. Wow, cool! Give us one. That's really sour. Mm. It tastes like lollies. Okay. We can take one of your kids if they want. And what are we doing? We're tasting. What do we think, Naomi? What are you trying? 100% chocolate. That's a lot. It's really strong. Can't wait, so we're gonna have some truffles. Before lunch, this is our Granada Chocolate Factory truffle selection. Give us a look and then oh, oh, yeah. And this is where they make the chocolate. Let's go check it out. I wish you could get the smell of this place on camera. It just smells like chocolate in here. It's amazing. This is the bean sorting room. Yeah, yeah. So you put 20 kilos on top. Temperature goes up to 250 Fahrenheit, roasting temperature. And that's the nutmeg in there. Nutmeg. It looks like and so it's kind of yeah. hard like cake. And then inside that, after well, it's it dries, not, it's, it's, it's like a fruity cake. It's be I, the nutmeg. So there's that. And it's got this really, I mean, that looks alien, doesn't it? It looks totally like something does. you would see on a movie. Yeah. Oh, is that the noise turtles make? Oh. Oh, what did you do, Good. Oh, that's good. Uh, B, uh, dung beetle. This is, this is your neighborhood. You know everyone here. Now, our little tours led us to the rum distillery. All the sugar, sugar came behind us. And of course, they're gonna be making some rum. Let's go check it out. Woo! Yeah. So this is where they put the sugar cane and this is, goes up, it's crushing it and it's all powered by that big water wheel. There it is, they're getting the sugar out of the sugar cane. There's sugar right there. And now they go make rum. Heating up the sugar. So we're just evaporating some of the water. That's all we are doing in here. This is where the fermentation process happens. And uh, so all of that sugar water, after it's heated, comes in here and it ferments. You can smell it. It's rotten sugar syrup. And as long as it's moving, it's bubbling and it's fermenting. And when it stops moving, that's when they've got their product the way that they want. So inside that room coming up, as much as possible, we are filling up that holding tank and that is as close as it can get to release into the boiler. So that's where you'd be cooking. So that's you'd Tasting be time. Can you tell us how the planes got here? The Cubans. That's the Cuban airline. Yeah. They bring it in. They came in here just a few days before the invasion. And then they fight, and this one remained here. Right. Cool. So this was in 1983. 1983. Stuff is like. I think this one's more deluxe. Yeah. The deluxe edition. Excuse me? The dilapidated deluxe. Why did the Americans come and invade here? Oh, because the Cubans were uh, taking. Well, the government was asking advice from the Cubans. Ah. Uh, what are you doing? I'm gonna feed a monkey. You're gonna feed. And you, you're not gonna. You're not gonna scream, right, Naomi? Who, who hasn't had a piece? Yeah.